Good day, everyone. Welcome back to the Obstacle Racing Media Weekly Video Program. I'm your host, Mappy Davis. Shortly joining me will be Josh Chase. Previously, we showed you a great video made by one Seb David. This video is going to be about winners and the bling. Let's go to Josh Chase, one of our favorite reporters. Thanks, Matt. Hey, everybody. It's Josh back from Stratton, Vermont and the North American Obstacle Course Racing Championships, where... I just completed four different events. If you have never competed at an adventure uh, event, whether it's the Obstacle Course Racing World Championships or the North American Championships, events for the weekend, there's typically four different events that happen, but a handful of things that racers get for all of these events. During the check-in process, everybody gets one of these. So if you've pre-registered, you get an athlete's badge that you can wear throughout the weekend that gets you into things like the dinner events, uh, free rides on the gondola at the ski resort, and having the badge really just gives you kind of that feel of being a you know an athlete on site during the weekend's event. So you get to wear this around and kind of show it off as you're uh, one of the competitors that'll be taking on the course here. The other thing that you'll get is your finisher shirt. So this is my finisher shirt for the 3K course. Each of them had a, a specific look and feel. So this is the 15K. Team event was pretty similar color wise to this. The last event of the weekend was a charity run. So everybody got a charity based t-shirt here. One thing that Adrian and team and his design company um, does better than anybody else are their medals. So last year we thought that in 2017, it was gonna hard, be hard to top you know, these medals with a little spinny leaf in the middle that we got in Blue Mountain, Canada. So these are the event uh, medals that you're gonna get. This is the charity medal. This is the team event medal that you get. Short course event matches the shirt, as you can tell. Your 15K medal for competing in the big course. The legendary silicone band for competing in these events. And these events, as you're probably familiar, are obstacle completion necessary. So if you want a podium, if you want to be in the rankings, you've got to complete all the obstacles. If the black one was for the, uh, the 3K on Friday, the white bracelet was for the 15K on Saturday, the red uh, bracelet for the team event. Matt will take it away and tell you about the results. Uh, but hopefully you guys came away with a whole bunch of new uh, t-shirts and a whole bunch of new pieces of swag after this weekend's events. Take care. Let's talk about those results. Short course, 3K, Friday. For the men, Ryan Atkins, VJ Jones, Jesse Bruce. Uh, for the women, Lindsay Webster, Nicole Miracle, and Alexandra Walker. Saturday on the standard 15K course, Ryan Atkins, Mark Battress, Jesse Bruce. Women's side, Lindsay and Nicole take first and second. April Cockshut takes third. I hope I'm saying that correctly. On Sunday, Ryan and Lindsay raced together and brought home another podium in the co-ed team event. Thanks so much for joining us. We've got lots of great content on the podcast and on this video channel. Please keep it locked to ORM. I gotta run.